everyone, Stacey Nicole here with Listen to Scraps, and I'm back with another haul. I had to go to the Dollar Tree because I wanted to pick my nephew's stuff up. My nephews live about four-ish hours away from me, and they live up clear up by Hocking Hills in Ohio. And I just don't get to see them as much as I'd like, so I like to spoil them and send them goodies, usually for every holiday. I thought with spring here and the warm weather, I'd send them a fun little package. And especially since they're stuck inside with the rain and everything, I sent them some fun stuff to do inside as well. So, I got a couple of things that the Dollar Tree was there. Uh, they had these clothespins, these larger clothespins. And I got some more sequins. And I got some more of this adhesive cork stock. I am going to try to die cut this and see how that works. So, um, I also had to go to TJ Maxx. Um, I picked some uh, storage bins up. I don't know if you can see these very well. They're cute little square ones. They were $3.99 for three. I picked six of them up. Sorry, smacking my camera with them. So, I also picked up this for my daughter-in-law for Mother's Day. It was really cute, and I thought that would help her plan stuff a little better. And for my mother-in-law, I picked up this. Best mom ever. How cute is that? Cute, cute, cute. And then I got this for 70 cents. Some book, little bookmark magnets. Not that I don't make my own bookmarks. I just don't even make one for me. And this next thing is going to be very hard to see. Um, so I got these bins here. I got how many of them? Four of them for $14.99. Kind of pricey. But I wanted something that was clear like that. And that I could use for Project Life cards. So there's that haul. And then I got a couple of fun things at Hobby Lobby on clearance. I got these really cute donut socks for my grandma. They're only $1.24. And I got these really pretty hair ties for $1.24 as well on clearance. Weirdest things you find at Hobby Lobby, I tell you. And for my mom for Mother's Day, she has like a nautical thing going with her house. So I got her this really pretty sand dollar thing. It says sun, sand, and sea. It's a little hanging plaque. Really pretty. It was 40% off. And then how to get more sequins. Not that I need them. Not that I ever use them. I am just addicted to buying them. They're so pretty. And I got this on clearance for my granddaughter. Uh, one of the fun things I am doing for my granddaughter is I have a, <coughs> excuse me, I have a couple shoe boxes, and every time she's into something new, I buy that. Like, she used to love Peppa Pig, so I went and bought a Pez dispenser, and I try to buy collectible things that may be worth money one day. Um, this is, um, Zoom Zoom? Zoom Zoom? Am I saying that right? Zoom? I have no idea, but it's a little patch. I thought maybe that might be worth money one day. I also got her this little Minnie Mouse at the Dollar Tree. And I'll put those in her box later. So, some scrapbooking stuff I got. Um, I thought I'd give these a try because I didn't know how big my cutting plates are. And I'm going to be doing a lot of die cutting here in the next few days. I thought I'd give these a try. But they are, they are a good chunk. About two inches smaller than mine. At least an inch. About an inch and a half. But I think they still work. We're going to give it a try anyway. They were on sale. And so was this. I couldn't resist. I thought that would be so pretty to make cards and use scraps of. And that is my haul, guys. It all starts because I had to go to the Dollar Tree for my nephews. It's their fault. <laughs> yeah, that's what we're saying anyway. All right, guys. Thanks for watching.